know are trapped and you're going to do just plain old double pox sound. So when I get to this point, we all can recognize this as our reference position, which is just like that. Gives the idea. So when I get here, I come here for this shot, come in to the inside, right there. So I want you to aim for number one, the chest, number two, cap your plumio. Okay? So we're going to come when we get to here, double pop. That'll be the first one. The second one, we're going to come at a slightly different angle. We've been talking a lot about angles this weekend, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come here, and instead of coming straight down, I'm actually going to come around. Okay, from here, I'm going to get the lops out, and I'm going to take the head right here. So one more time. I'm going to come this way to this side. There you go. As we are. Right on the button. I want to move this line here. That. That. Um, partners, keep both eyes in your head. So as we are here, this clear from here, the same way you can unlock and wave it. Matter of fact, you can unlock and wave it. You can hit your thumb cap. You can hit your second line right here. So without, without this for race safety, without this for race safety, boom. Right in, 
this or boom You're going to cross, rip it, cut down, and whole body weight shift, and straight up and through. And then catch at the end, you can, and go ahead and throw. Okay, sir. So, as I pass here, all I do is I let my stick roll down under here, basically pinning it into my armpit. My other hand is going to pick that up, hit him, and then I'm going to pin it back to my other hand. And then we're still in the drill. If you do this right, it should not interrupt the flow of the drill. Now, there's actually several hits that are happening here. The first hit is on the low line. Boom, right there. And I immediately hand it right back into my hand. The second hit comes as I'm handing the stick back. I'm actually going to break this across his eye line. So, we have two simultaneous hits in the flow. We have a low line shot, and then we have an eye rake, which I'm going to do. The more comfortable you can come with it, the sweeter it's going to look. So, you guys see that? So, as I'm passing, right, as he's catching my stick, he passes that over. I'm tucking it right underneath my arm bit. My other hand reaches up, hits him in the body, breaks across his eyes, and hands back up to my other hand. Then we're back in the room. Drop and back. That's it. Okay, so we're going to get from here. There's new visions. I haven't done this in forever, so I may actually mess up. Okay, so when he taps me, I'm going to go like this and hit my hand. Right and now this hand is going to tap this here, clear that off, so it's going to bite like that. And then he comes back in, then I'm back on this side, back out like that. Okay? So, this is like this, it passes me, this goes, it rolls, and it's going to use this hand to clear it like that. I just make it clear it that Okay? And then I can just whip it out. I can do the same thing with Chad did. Now here's the next one. It's going to roll here. Tap, and this time I'm going to take it and put it here, mm -hmm. and now I have mm -hmm. the rope. Okay. So, go through. switch, this clears, and I can put it right here on the bend of the elbow, and catch it like this. I can keep it out here on the wrist, or I can scoop it and do all the, all the throws. Everybody knows these throws, right? You throw it down, you kneel here like this, and then you use your stick as a lever, where you put it in space, and then you use it as a lever. Put it under his head, use it as a lever, and then you suck it up. Remember those? So, now I'm just doing it on my lid. We normally do them off the punch, but so we do it when we're switching hands. It allows us to put them here on this side. Okay? Okay, so then we're going to wheel like this, and run it. This is going to go all the way up to the tip of the head like this, slash out, and hook back to this position here, and then catch up. Like that. It's all stuff you've seen before. Repackaged into a different hoobit. This is the 2010 hoobit, <laughs> as opposed to the 2009 hoobit. Okay, so we're not here. Like this is so a we'll tick here. Hit, hook behind the head, catch him like this, and then do your cool little ski lot move. Get like that. Whip him to whatever you want to do. Okay? So from this side. Here, this, tap the hand off, tap the hand off, hook, what are you doing from there? Second, whip here, back under, back over, this position, and then last, flip the tick, hook into that position. Got it? Alright, let's do it.